Hello everybody, this is Chuck from Mobley Motors and I wanted to take a quick moment to show you um, the new Compass, all new Compass 2018. This particular one is a Trailhawk. Uh, for those of you that don't know, the Trailhawk is a kind of a more off-road edition, has a has an off-road type suspension, but you can still drive it on the road. Uh, it also has another cool couple features about it. Have the, the uh, red accents like on the hooks. You have a uh, black matte stripe down the middle, which actually is functionable. It helps keep glare off of the uh, out of your eyes when you're driving. You also get the nice, nice looking rims. Got nice little trail rated badging. Kind of go around the outside of it here. There's another red hook in the back. Of course, your Trailhawk badge again. They did a really good job with this compass as far as looks, I believe. Uh, it just has a great look to it. As you can see, uh, I think it looks very much like the uh, Grand Cherokees do. Much more than the old compasses. The old compasses had a much more boxy look. Alright, let's take a look on the inside here. This particular one does have the uh, proximity um, access, which means if you have the keys in your pocket, you just grab the handle and the doors unlock. Power seat on the Trailhawk. Have that nice red accent stitching, as well as accents around the speakers. <coughs> does have the Trailhawk uh, embroidery as well as more red stitching along the seats there. And then we'll go ahead and turn it on so you can take a look at the, at the inside of it. So there's what your middle uh, cluster looks like. Of course, the, uh, the electronic part in the middle here, right there, is customizable. You can have it show you different things. You have the all-new radio, which does have Android Auto and Apple CarPlay in it. There's for your climate control. And then uh, one thing that is exclusive to the Trailhawk is you have uh, hill descent control. You have a four-wheel um, low setting, and then you have a rock setting. Uh, it's in auto all the time, so you don't have to worry about changing it in and out, especially like if you're in Missouri where the weather, you never know if a road's going to be covered or not. Uh, super, super nice. The center here does slide up, so you have a nice place to put your arm. Nice big storage area there. And of course you have all your connections. You have a 12 volt, and then you have an auxiliary jack as well as a USB. All right, that's about the, all on the front here. We'll take a look at the back real quick. Again, very good look and feel to it got the red stitching you do have vents in the back and you also have a USB and a 110 volt back here for connections and in the trunk you've got uh, this one has the mats and stuff it is a lit trunk so you have lighting and then you have all your stuff down in here, your funnel, your spare tire, uh, a little extra storage for other things, as well as these big, deep storage pockets on the sides. So anyway, I hope this uh, it was a good look for you. I, uh, I, like I said, I really do think that they did a fantastic job on the compasses. Um, drivability too, as far as the way they drive, they drive so nice compared to what the uh, old compasses did. If you want to know any more information, don't hesitate to reach out to me either by phone. You can comment on the social media platforms, um, whatever you want to do. But thank you so much and have a great day.